Okay, here, here we've got a, an image. This is your logo, you upload it. Up here is um, how you resize it. Now these are pixels, not inches or centimeters. And what you re need is really, for Second Life in most virtual worlds, is a 512, at least on one side. You can tick here to keep your percentage of portions. And uh, click OK. Now, um, after that, you can do whatever it is your program allows you to do in the way of um, changing the exposure, adding colors, adding graphics, and so on. Um, but from here, we would like to save it. And uh, what we need to do is change the... Um, how do I move this? Can I move this? No, I can't move it. So anyway, it says please enter a file name because it had a rubbish name. Um, it wouldn't make any sense for what I'm doing, and I want always want the, the title of your file to uh, correspond with something of your project. So this is cellular art log logo for Wiz WYSIQ or WiseIQ, and um, so I'm going to put. Uh, I'll put WYSIQ, just so I know to find it. Logo. So you're alright. And I'm saving it at 512 by 259. And I'm going to take it up to the best resolution. It's a JPEG. And then I go and go like this. And then I choose a um, folder to put it in. I've chosen my pictures. Uh, it's got the same name. I'm not going to change the name to save it here. And click. It's saving me. Now from here, all I really want is a simple logo. Sell your art. But um, for the purposes, really, of um, uh, using this logo, I'm making it in several sizes. So I'm going to resize. I'm going to go 100. Oops, something's not right. Okay. 100 by 51. Just a little tiny logo. That's good enough for me. But I might just do that for, oh no, it won't do it. So, here we go. And that's lovely and neat. And then we save it. Wiz, Wiz IQ logo. Still your art. And I put in 100 by 50, and I know that's a pixel, and it's the best quality. And then I save, press the save button, save here, and I continue doing that. Now I can upload this uh, 512 and smaller up to Second Life. You pay 10 cents. Uh, 10 Linden dollars uh, out of your account to upload it and you can use it in all sorts of things. Now this isn't a very very big file. If I was uploading artwork I would upload it at the lowest possible um, value because you don't want people can save your images to file and print them out. So you wouldn't want to give them a, a, a really fabulous um, uh, image. You want to give something that's representational of your real life work and uh, an indication of what they can find on your websites where you're offering prints and canvas and all that sort of stuff or original artworks, whatever, which way, ever way you work. So uh, just be careful on that, that point.